Welcome back, everybody, to Fairgrounds TV. I'm Peter Muller of Fairgrounds Wine and Spirits of Danbury, Connecticut. And since I tasted my last dogfish head on here, the Sati, and I thought it was great, I picked up the uh, Teo Brahma. Uh, it's 9% alcohol. It's made with chilies, cocoa nibs, cocoa powder, annatto. Um, real cool story behind this. Go check it out on uh, dogfishhead.com or dogfish.com, I'm sorry. Um, you can even find a little video with Sam telling you what the deal is. But uh, it sounded delicious. Have to try it. Uh, nice uh, little hazy, light orange-ish. Uh, very thin head. Um, not as thick as I thought it would be. Not as dark as I thought it would be brewing, being brewed with cocoa powder. But uh, Very interesting. Uh, it, I believe this also has a little bit of honey in it, so the honey is coming through for the sweetness, but not so much cocoa. It just smells like a very refreshing, lighter, orangish beer. It's kind of funky. Uh, let's check it out. Wow. That tastes nothing like it smells like. But that's a fantastic beer. Again, Dogfish Head doing it to me for saying that I didn't like their 60, their 90, their 120. They're making it up in the Big Bottle series. That chili comes through. It's not a spice. It's more of just a flavor. Um, there's no spiciness or burning at all. The cocoa is very faint. Nice, subtle sweetness. Um, getting a little tingly from the chilies going down. But it's great. Let's put the name up on the board so you know what it looks like. Um, this is definitely something to check out. It almost has like a little bit of a mead side to it. I've had some chili mead before, um, and uh, it, it's very spicy. This is a sweet, mild, mild spiced chili pepper flavor with very slight like cocoa nibs. Like you can understand why he uses the cocoa nibs because it's not that sweet. But uh, this is a pretty interesting beer. I know we haven't come across one that I really haven't liked yet, but I gotta tell you, Dogfish had doing it again for me. Um, check it out. Check us out online at greatcorks.com. You can buy this little guy up there within the next couple days. So uh, check it out and we will see you next time.